What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Julia and today we're doing a classic 10 minute tone. This is gonna be a 10 minute tone core workout. So there's gonna be a lot less crunching exercises and more stabilization. So really think about getting that belly button towards spine, keep those ribs in those pockets, engage that core. I probably sound like a broken record, but trust me, it's important. Just think about that belly button towards spine. Just like always, 10 exercises, one minute per exercise. I've got the exercises and the timer, so listen for the beeps. Let's get into it. Okay, we are starting off nice and simple with an elbow plank hold. And go. Keeping that belly button towards spine, shoulders right over top of your elbows. Keep those hips down in line with your shoulders. Next, we're rolling over onto our back for dead bugs. So, working in opposition. Belly button towards spine, keep that low back on the ground. We're gonna flip back over for bird dogs next. Back on all fours. Just like dead bugs, we're working in opposition, keeping that belly button towards spine, engage that core. Don't let that low back arch. Next, we have a Pilates move. It's a star pulse. Okay, so you're on your right knee, left leg out to the side, hands spread out. You're gonna be pulsing down. Keep those ribs tucked in your pocket. You'll feel it in your obliques. Don't let your ribs flare like this. Keep them in. Next, we're gonna be switching sides. Switch. Left leg is bent, right leg is out. Pulsing, get those fingertips to the floor.
Next we have Pilates hundreds. This is a classic Pilates move. It burns. Okay, on our backs. Feet bent up to 90, little knees bent. We're pulsing our arms, keeping that core engaged. Do you wanna make it harder? Straighten your legs. If you wanna make it even harder, you can start to lower your legs. Keep that core engaged though. Don't lose your form. Next we have Pilates toe taps. Okay, so we're still gonna be on our back. Keep that core engaged, low back on the floor. Tapping one toe down at a time. Don't just bend your knee, actually lower your leg. If your core is engaged properly, this should be difficult. Next, we're gonna move on to a right side elbow plank hold. That right elbow is down on the ground, feet out straight, stack them, make them harder. If you want it easier, put one in front of the other. Keep a nice straight body line, don't let those hips sag, you want to keep them up. If you want to make this harder, add dips. Next, we're going to be switching sides. Switch onto your left elbow. Feet out and hold. Just like before, if you want to make it harder, add those dips for the last 30. Next, we have a quadruped bird dog. So back on all fours, but we're gonna hover those knees above the ground in our quadruped position. The goal is to raise in opposition, keeping a nice, stable core. Flat back the whole time. If this is too hard, you can raise one arm, other arm, one leg, other leg. But the goal is do opposition. This can be something you can work up towards. Act 
activity completed. And rest. Okay, that is it for today's 10 minute tone core workout. I really hope you guys enjoyed that. My core and my obliques are on fire, so I hope yours are too. <laughs> Just a reminder that my ebook, Challenge Accepted, is available for instant PDF download on my website, juliamerwin.com. But other than that, let's end this video off here. Hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you guys on Monday for my next video. Bye.